I've got my notes here, but it goes without saying that uh, it is good to see you all. Um, and also uh, that we miss the people that aren't able to come here today uh, for whatever reason. Um, not necessarily that we didn't invite them, but it's only 30 votes, but uh, uh, we do listen. Thanks to Stuart for the fiber for his Douglas recently celebrated 30 years of uh, service to the fishery. Douglas. <laughs> <laughs> Alan is uh, pointed out next year is our 50th anniversary, so with a bit of deduction, Elma was in it from the start selling permits, that means she's been working here for 49 years. Woo! <laughs> As a wee uh, point of interest today, I think the zombie trout it should still be out there. It's a strange looking thing with a kind of yellow pigmentation. Uh, I think it's quite attractive, but other people don't. But uh, if you catch it, first person to catch it and get a photograph will get a free boat. Um, and now to the main point of the day. Traditionally it's been a woman that opens the, the fishing, um, but finding a willing <coughs> woman uh, who is... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, the connection uh, to the fishery uh, was getting increasingly harder to find, so we thought well, we'll have a, a, a change of tack and uh, we thought get a VIP and Gordon Watson, uh, 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 who is uh, the chief executive of uh, the National Park, uh, where we're standing today, and um, fits the bill precisely. Um, so, thanks, Gordon, for coming along. Pleasure. Pleasure. Thank you. I understand that I'm a, a complete break in tradition, as I've said. Uh, it's usually an attractive woman who apparently usually gives you a song before you set off, so <laughs> I can assure you I'm going to break with tradition and I won't be, I'll have to disappoint you on those two fronts, but um, I would like to take full credit for the, for the magnificent day that you've got today. It's really <laughs> magnificent, so I'll, I'll take full credit for uh, providing you with the weather and I hope you have a, um, a great day. Um, it's a real pleasure to be here. Uh, the Lake of Manteith is one of the absolute gems of the National Park. Um, not only is it one of the best, well the, the best and well-known fishery in the National Park, it's got natural uh, cultural heritage of Inchbohone Priory, it's a, a, a concert, important conservation site um, the, 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 uh, being a designated water, it's a popular visitor location um, and it's a place where people can come and see osprey fishing uh, on the lake. Um, I believe we've not actually seen them back this year yet, so maybe as well as catching the fish, um, anyone who sees the first one today, maybe they'll come back today to give us a Free shout. Free <laughs> 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 there we go. Well done. That's nice a good man. <laughs> um, so it, it's really a, a, a magnificent place, but uh, obviously, most importantly, um, you know, a great fishing spot in the national park. And fishing is really important, uh, right, right over the national park. One of the most popular pastimes um, brings a lot of people into the park. Um, and the great thing about it is how, how accessible it is for so many people right across central Scotland and, and that's what we're here for. So um, it's great, great to see you all here today. Um, I don't have a, a song. Um, what I do have for you is um, a, a joke, I think, and a, a, piece of, a piece of advice. I'm afraid I'm, I'm not a fisherman, but um, somebody has given me some advice to read out to you, which I'm not convinced about. I, I might be about to make a bit of a backside myself, but I'll, uh, I'll do the joke first. Um, apparently there was a, 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 a retired GP who used to live around the port of Manteith uh, and one day when he was out fishing he, he got a call from a local farmer um, whose wife was about to deliver a, 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 a baby. Um, so having delivered the baby there was nothing around to, to weigh it to find out um, um, what, what the birth weight was going to be. Um, 
apparently uh, th this doctor was very uh, famous for catching very large fish so he had his, his fishing scales to, to go and weigh this baby so he got, and got those and went back and weighed the baby and apparently it was £22.13 ounces. <laughs> 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 so, the, the, the advice I have for you today, I'm not really convinced about. I'm going to read it anyway, and then you'll be, if it'll either be good advice or you'll be laughing at me because I don't know much about fishing. But the best advice for opening today is to head for the butts. I know that the, those are the butts, but head for the butts, midge, midge tit wine, booby on the point. Is that correct? Booby on the point? Uh -huh. And black buzzers on the droppers. So that's apparently <laughs> the, the advice I've been giving for today. <laughs> so, well, that's fair or not, I don't know. Um, but I hope you have a magnificent day. I, I, I don't think I've seen a better day in the lake. I, I really um, hope this is the start of a great season for you and you get more and more days like this as you go through the season. So without much further ado, I'd like to declare the, the season open and hope you have a great day out there today. Thank you. Yeah. really magnificent to be here on uh, such a beautiful day at the opening, opening of the fishing season on the Lake of Monteith. Uh, Lake of Monteith is one of the great gems of the National Park, um, not only for the quality of the fishing that's available here, but uh, the cult not cultural heritage of Inchmohan Priory, many families going over to see that, um, and obviously it's great conservation importance as well, uh, and a place where we can enjoy things like uh, osprey fishing in the water, as well as looking at the magnificent landscape around here. Um, so it's a wonderful place to come. Today I think uh, it was was a good, uh, you couldn't ask for better weather, we've been blessed with the weather. Uh, you just, we're having a, a roast pork later on, a spit roast, and uh, uh, it could be a bit of a disaster if the weather's not good, so it's been fantastic. All our boats are out, I mean, it's people are fighting hand over fist to try and get, get on, so it's never a problem filling the boats on opening day, even the worst of weather. But uh, okay, it's great to see everybody. You, you go for five, six, five months of the year without uh, seeing a lot of people and then suddenly you're inundated. So you can get a bit, uh, bit nervy making sh ensuring that everything's ready for opening day, but uh, okay, it's gone well. The tunes are great, great to see everybody. Uh, and it was great to have Gordon Watson from the park here just to see what we do. Um, so I'm very pleased with how things have gone.